hey guys welcome back to my channel from today's video as you can see from the title we are going to be doing a review off of my medium ysl envelope chain bag if you are unfamiliar okay unfamiliar with the ysl bag i encourage you and i will also make sure to put a link down below of the brand ysl they are absolutely gorgeous 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 girls um or gorgeous gorgeous boys um but yeah um i absolutely love the brand so again i will make sure to put down their link down below and also if you are interested in watching more about my video please continue to keep watching and on top of that i'll go ahead and include time slots so if you are looking for specific things for my video for today look down below and let's go ahead and get on to it oh and i also forgot to tell you guys if you are already interested in your girl go ahead and hit that subscribe button go ahead and give me a thumbs up because you know you want this information and you might as well go ahead and follow me on my tiktok and my instagram which will also be on the link below let's talk about the reason why i chose ysl as my first luxury piece so I'm not gonna lie to you, I didn't really know about YSL until maybe about I was in college. Um, I just always known um, YSL for their luxury statements, the little logo YSL, and it's gold, it's daring, it's tasteful, it's sexy, it's classy. And being that I'm that type of girl, I needed that bag and so i was just like oh my gosh and i used to just scroll look at their stuff all the freaking time so that's kind of how i got introduced to ysl and kind of just like really studied like their different types of bags um so yeah you know they they're always known i mean they've been out for decades you know years um and then just their logo was just very attractive to me um, the way that their style and their materials of their actual bags, just very great quality overall, essentially. And I was like, I have to have it. You know what I mean? Um, so that was kind of my reason as to why I kind of gotten into needing this YSO bag. Um, and again, I'll make sure to include um, the link specifically to their website and or just the link to my bag and then you can just continue to explore so yeah that was the reason why i um wanted this bag so now we need to talk about when i was actually available to get this freaking bag so if you are still interested please keep on watching i was available to get this bag i was on a honeymoon um i got married back in september um and if you want a separate video about my experience in hawaii let me know but yeah i got it in hawaii um last september and oh my gosh first off hawaii from what i was told with certain luxury pieces their taxes are a little bit cheaper but i had already made up my mind sis i was just like i'm gonna get this bag and i'm gonna get it so I had got it and my experience overall there was phenomenal from the customer service to me getting into the door, the ambiance and essentially just everywhere around of how their um, store was just so beautiful. Um, very minimal, but again, you saw the different bags and the, you know, the wallets and et cetera and so you knew where everything was kind of placed and it just enhanced really the the experience so i'm gonna kind of paint a picture for you so when i walked in i was greeted by like two or three people you know um like hey how are you you know let me know if you need anything they were very chill so i didn't have that type of like sales pressure to go ahead and you know answer all these questions so that way they can kind of like push for a sale it was just very laid back and so maybe like 10 minutes go by like you know i'm chatting with my spouse and i specifically like looked at a bag and then i started asking my sa which is a sales associate like certain questions about the envelope bag 
and he was very informative he knew exactly what he was talking about he let me and allowed me to like try on the different bags add his commentary like oh this one looks really good and whatever i had almost um started looking at like a different color bag but in my mind i was like i want the black and gold because again that is something that i just absolutely love <laughs> so um you know i started looking at the different colors and stuff and then um a good tip that i think i would recommend anybody research 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 know what you know the type of bags that you want know the type of um i guess type of materials i mean maybe not materials per se but i would definitely say the finances part like just already know what to kind of expect so that way you can relay whatever you need to relay to your SA um, because for the most part, sometimes the tags are underneath or inside the actual bags um, from experience experiences of walking into certain luxury stores. And so I just wanted to make sure that one, I'm not wasting my time and I'm not wasting nobody else's time. I feel like some of the um, SAs sometimes are commission based or they really want to just make sure that hopefully at the end of the day you make the right choice for yourself but also like i just personally don't want to waste people's time and i just already knew in my head like i'm getting that back point blank and period so i had already did my research i was already like enthused with my um kind of shopping around experiences as i just confirmed that this is the actual bag that i wanted you get what i'm saying so he was just very um, involved, engaged, excited with me. Um, we, so again, that presentation was just very attractive to me. And so overall, that experience allowed me to really just have a good time um, since this was my first like luxury experience. So yeah, that is kind of um, how I ended up getting the bag. Um, so yeah, now we need to go ahead and talk about my actual bag that i know you guys are dying to see so why not go ahead and just reveal this baby now when it came to the packaging i definitely feel like they delivered i was really excited when you know i went out when i did my checkout process you know they gave me this tall bag and that tall bag just really set the tone because it just made me feel like i made a really big girl purchase and then when i took out the big um when i took out the um the box out of that big bag it was just so nice i really love the texture of the box the box had like this cute little black ribbon and then on the inside they still had like the little paper um paper bags with the actual sticker of saint laurent and it was just again tasteful minimum but it just really stood out to me because i just really like that feel i feel like presentation and the packaging is very important and so i personally like kept all of that stuff because i like to be remembered that oh my gosh like what a great experience like i'm gonna just forever hold on to that so i really enjoyed that for sure so um the bag came in a cute dust bag that looks just like this And I really like that because it protects the actual bag um, from getting damaged or has cosmetic, you know, stains on them. Um, this is what the medium size look like. And on the back, it has pockets on the inside. I don't really put anything on it. So that's that. This is how the change drop like so when you open up the actual bag I like to open it up from this side on the angles because if you actually open this piece right here over time it's gonna bend and we want to just make sure that it's in somewhat good condition over time and so you open it up and it looks like this and it has the logo Saint Laurent I still have the cute little bags I 
feel like it's very decent in size so that's always a plus and it does have um a little slot in here if you wanted to maybe put like a couple cards or something um so i think that's pretty cool comes with an authentication um type of card that validates that this is the real YSL bag. Gives you like care instructions on how to maintain your bag. Gives you like the serial number for the actual um, product, um, which you can keep that to your discretion. Also wanted to say, um, after I made the purchase, I had a personalized email and text from my SA saying like hey it was so great to see you i hope that you enjoy um you know hawaii so far i just wanted to kind of give you a recap as i'm always available he gave me his name his name was jason in hawaii if you're ever interested in going down there and he um gave me his uh phone number again we exchanged phone numbers and just that follow-up personal personalized like email meant so much to me as a customer especially because of two things one I've never like experienced this right so you're kind of not knowing what to really expect except for you're gonna pay this money and then second of all I think because of how much it costs it lets you know as a consumer that you are a valuable client because the goal is for them to have you come back to the place so i just kind of wanted to touch base on that because i thought that was very important and that, that really just stood out to me that i got this really nice paragraph and a half of like hey like you know thank you so much for visiting ysl i mean who does that but i thought that was really nice so yeah hey guys sorry my phone died so the camera might look a little bit different compared to what you were just watching a few seconds ago i think that this bag is very special to me and it's definitely worth um every single penny because the quality is there um and the material is just very nice and delicate so you do have to make sure that you are very careful with this bag make sure to again Put that down below and or just write it down so that way you can check it out um, at your leisure but um this bag is just everything to me again it's classy it's elegant it's stylish it's sexy it's very tasteful um you can put a lot of stuff in this bag without it being too overbearing for an example i can actually show you what i put in this bag in another video so that way you can kind of have some ideas especially if you are actually going to get this bag or um if you just wanted some ideas you know what i'm saying so yeah and you speaking of which i like to wear this bag at nice um outings such as like dinner brunch sometimes even when i like run errands sometimes um, i'm just very careful in particular about when i wear this bag or when i go out in public you know making sure that the sun um does not beam down too much because it, that can actually factor into the wear and tear over time so it's just little things like that that you know you just have to be considerate about but I'm gonna wear this bag. I'm gonna use my bag. I'm not gonna just let it sit there. I worked very hard, and that's another reason why I, it's very special to me because I worked very hard to obtain that bag, and I um, just feel very like happy that I was able to get the bag of my choice. Um, so with that being said, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely let me know what's your favorite bag from YSL. Do you have this bag? If so, what's the color? What's the size? Tell me everything because i want to know because i'm nosy but um yeah i hope you guys like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video bye